Welcome back to E's live post show. So I want I want the cast of Lost to be on its best behavior because we're live, you guys. Okay, good luck to you. You said you should be really afraid that Naveen Andrews has the mic. Uh oh, Naveen, what, what are you gonna do? Let me give it to you. Why? No, okay, you take it, Evangeline. Someone else take it. No, keep it down there. What is going on? Who is the biggest troublemaker on this ca in this cast? <laughs> I think he's standing right over here. Step, step out, I know. <laughs> so you guys, how exciting when you heard that you guys won? Because you know you guys had some pretty stiff competition, tough competition tonight. Yeah, yeah. What was the reaction when you guys when you guys won? When you heard Lost announced? I spontaneously screamed out loud like a girl, which I try not to do on all occasions. <laughs> You're like. Ah! <laughs> really? I thought Deadwood would win. You know, there's such a good show, and there were so many good shows this year, but I, I thought Deadwood would win. You yeah, know? I thought Ian was going to win, you know? Um, I thought he was going to win best So it was, it was shock. To be nominated with all those other shows was just fantastic. Now, it must be great to be on such a super show, but there's got to be, the downside has to be everyone must come up to you guys and want to know what's going on. Like, everywhere you go to dinner, do you get that all the time with people wanting to know? Yeah, but at least secrets. they want to know. I okay. mean, you know, yeah. they, it's not like they're not bothered, you know, and like just want you to disappear. Yeah. No, they're interesting. It means the fans are passionate about our show, and that says something great about the storytelling. So as long as that keeps up, that means we've got something good going. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. a good thing that they're asking these questions constantly. Yeah. Do your, do don't your, know, right? What's that? Most don't really want to know. They want to yeah. know until you start to act like you're going to tell them. And then they and go, then no, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> they want to know that they can know. <laughs> no, no. Is, is there like a contract? Is there something you guys have to sign or, or something where you're not allowed to say? Because, it's kind I mean, of unwritten. Yeah. You know, you know okay. that you're going to get sacked. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, Damon, why don't you come in here as the man behind, one of the men behind this, Damon Lindelof. The man behind the curtain, Damon Lindelof. producer. Yeah, do you threaten do you threaten their lives as far as uh, what they can and can't say? She's nodding her head over there. I wouldn't say threaten their lives. I would say we, we make suggestions. Family. You know, friends, family, the withholding of goods, that sort of a thing, basically. So when you were coming up, you know, when you were working on the show and kind of the pre-production phases of it, were you like, hmm, where can we shoot? We could shoot in Wisconsin. We could shoot in Maryland, where I'm from. Sure. Or we could shoot in Hawaii. Right. We also considered Kansas. Didn't work. Mm. But, uh, but Hawaii is not too shabby. Had to be Hawaii. But we, we uh, when uh, JJ and I wrote the pilot, we from from the moment that uh, we decided to do the show to the moment that we delivered the show was about uh, 10 or 11 weeks. So we were basically like, Hawaii, Hawaii, Hawaii. It's got to be Hawaii. And they, they were like, okay. I think if anybody had time to think about it, they would have shipped us off to New Zealand, which I hear is very, very lovely. It's very nice. Yeah, and then after that, yeah. wonderful. Yeah. Some I think after that we're gonna go the whole CSI route and do like Lost Wisconsin. It'll be a lot, good. Yeah. a lot more cheese. No, it has to be Lost Wisconsin with a question mark. Yeah, yeah right, then right. Maybe, really could be, could God forbid. Yeah. God forbid. Yeah. Yes. Wow. Have you guys thought about? First of all, are these are these heavy. I haven't, haven't really. Okay. No, I haven't. Do you mind, you Damon? Please? We go way back. You gotta do. It's beautiful. Juliana. My oh. God. Thank you. For my fine reporting on E. Uh oh, there's a spill in the E press room. That's okay. Thank you. You can't trust this cast of Ross. Come on in. That's okay. Uh, that's very beautiful. So, you guys, seriously, though. JJ. <laughs> JJ's like, I'm sorry. I spilled my Diet Coke. What can I do? Um, so, tell me, really, though, as far as what you're playing, like, how far ahead have you written the episodes? How far ahead are you? Uh, I have literally not been in the writer's room this year. So, and this is very honest. No, uh, the truth is that uh, the man behind me, uh, the man behind me, uh, Carl Where Hughes, and, uh, I'm, uh, this is uh, and Damon Lindelof are really the day-to-day -day on the season. I, I wish I could take more credit for this year than I can, uh, than I, you know, but you should talk to them. And there's a spilled drink situation, too. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> terrible. I'm trying to focus, but all I can think about is... Yeah, right. Can we get a Stop shot of the Look, spilled drink? Don't worry, you can write I'm sorry, what do you want from me? All right, on that note, we're going to get someone to mop this show. up. Thank you for keeping your foot in it, though. I appreciate that. You're very sweet. Just drag your feet uh, on your way go out and clean right up. Thank you guys for stopping by. We're going to go now while we clean up our mess. You guys, congratulations, a super show. I hope you are on the air for 20, 30 more years.